Welcome, welcome to Vlogtober day number nine. And I'm so tired today that I'm actually doing it already at 9.30 p.m. So this is my wrap up of today. My wonderful Dreamweaver, so happy to be here today because I actually, you know, managed to get a couple of things done. But let's get started with my little quick recap of the day. Um, it started with, you know, me getting up at some point. I don't even, because last night was until two o'clock in the morning. So I'm grateful that my nieces didn't wake me up until a little bit before eight. And they didn't wake me up because they came up here. I just heard them, you know do their thing going the excitement of the morning so i was able to you know lie in bed a little bit and then before getting up um and then of course you know getting ready and you know getting up i decided to do some work um downstairs in the kitchen to be closed i think i didn't get breakfast slash brunch slash lunch until 10 30 so what you're seeing here is me you know that was around 11 12 11 ish sort of you know working doing make making some food for myself keep kept on working um I was very happy that I was able to finalize my weekly video. This is one of the things that happened before Vlogtober that I decided that I can create a video each week. Um, you know how everybody tells you you have to have a content calendar. Of course, I tried that and I do have a couple of topics that I want to talk to you guys about. And I, and I already, guys and girls, I have to, you know, I'm a 90s kid because you hear me saying you guys. And I've realized that that's actually not a very good wording to use. So I'm sorry for that. I will try to change that. But anywho, uh, for you beautiful dream weavers out there, um, I already have four recorded videos, although they're not, I'm not very happy with them. But hey, you know, in case I don't manage to record a proper video for a Wednesday, I would have those. Um, but and I don't know how I got to the Wednesday. I think it's because of the YouTube challenge in the NAS Academy. Me, I might, you know, move it to Mondays or Fridays because usually Fridays are my sort of days off of my VA position. So I, because I, I wanted to have, you know, a long weekend for my stuff like this coaching, like the vlogging, like, you know, energy coaching and ADHDers and empaths and spiritual, you know, woo woo, how some people say, you know, the spiritual stuff. But anywho, um, where was I? So yeah, so that's me working there, you know, eating, lunching, working. That's what my days usually look like. Um, it was an amazingly beautiful day outside. So I decided I need to go outside. And I had one meeting, you know, it was a network meeting. I haven't done one of those in a while. And I thought it was pretty nice to have that invitation of uh, someone on LinkedIn that wrote to me like, hey, you know what, like, I'd like to get to know you. We never know if there's some synergies or collaborations or whatever. Why don't we meet? And I was like, oh, well, why not? And um, because I, you know, and then, you know, I decided, okay, let's have it. But because I haven't, you know, like the last two days were not very moving with me. I took my, um, I took that phone call on a walk. So this is what you see here. A little impressions of my walk, of how the beautiful sun was shining, how the trees were looking as always. It was a beautiful conversation. I think we spoke almost 45 minutes or even longer, a little longer. Um, an amazing woman. I think it's interesting how she managed to do her things with her husband, um, a beautiful company in Portugal. And I'm very much looking forward to whatever might come up. Um, and uh, yeah, so that's one of the things that are out there. And um, after that lunch meeting, um, I basically right away came home because I had promised my sister that I would pick up my nieces from kindergarten and take them to the library because we have library kids now for a couple of months they have been I mean I, it's my <laughs> it's actually my thing that I have with them it's my um my card I registered at the library here and it's sort of my thing to go with my nieces on top of that I was supposed to return two books no actually all of the last books on Saturday it's actually our Saturday thing we go there Saturday they look for new books and we bring back the old books and this week my nieces wanted to have their wanted to keep two books and we didn't have time on Saturday of course you know why so we went on Friday and noticed that they're closing on Fridays right now because I'm, apparently they're understaffed so we couldn't return those we couldn't prolong the two books we, returning is possible but prolonging them wasn't and I completely forgot on Saturday so I had you know I had to pay a fee and I didn't want to prolong that as well and I figured hey I, I mean I have to you know my sister had uh, a training and because of that she asked me to you know take care of the girls for about an one an hour and a half or two and I said oh come on why not go to the library with them they always love going to the library and sitting down and actually reading books I had to rush them a little bit because we they also wanted to get ice cream and I didn't want that to be too late so we went to have ice cream and then our favorite ice cream parlor place um, is shutting down tomorrow so they didn't have many ices but just you know just enough for one last little ice uh, is it called ice ball for each of my nieces and a little ice for my mom and I as well um, and then we returned, you know, I was, um, I thought that I would pass on my nieces there, but uh, the little one didn't want to go to their next uh, event that they had. And so I said, of course, I'm going to stay and hang out with her. Um, again, I had a beautiful, you know, beautiful moments with, with my tiny one. She's amazing. I love her so much. And um, yeah, and then I had another meeting with a colleague of mine because we're, you know, we're, uh, I'm allowed to pass on a couple of things um, as a VA there. And then another, you know, and I had a coaching tonight, which was amazing as well. Beautiful. Um, with this wonderful um, client of mine that we've been working on a couple of things and I just love seeing how it's you know it's it's taking fruits keeping giving fruits 
how it's fruitful. I think that's a good word. But yeah, so that's that's it from my day today. But I still have a little something for you because if you remember two days ago, I said there was a little collaboration thingy. And our prompt for today is actually collaborations. And uh, the funny thing is that I recorded one part and with that colleague of mine who's also doing Vlogtober, by the way, and another Vlogtober colleague today also asked me about it. So that's why I'm going to show you a little conversation that I had. Um, and yeah, and how we did our, you know, our collaboration was nice. I think we spoke almost an hour. It was, and I hope that I was able to help my colleague with that. So that's in the collaboration part. I'm adding it oh, here. Right now I'm only showing you how to do the subtitles. Yeah, and then we'll do the pictures. I'm using your video. <laughs> so you. Oh yeah, the yeah. There you go. See, so what you could. Thank you. So was you? Was it you? No, it wasn't you. It was someone else who asked for it. Was it you? No, it's not employed. I think. Yeah. So you see, you have that. You have the subtitles here, right? That you have yeah. that you can use, right? But this and this is auto generated in the language it understands from the video. So you have automatically English down there. And then you can go here into settings and then you go into subtitles. See, yeah. see, it already generated this automatically. Oh, okay, okay. And you can go into like if, for me, for example, because I'm German, right? So you, you have the Telugu and you have the English or Spanish, right? So you go auto translate. Look how many languages it has for auto translation. Three, three. Right. And let's say, I don't know, I'm going to go with Spanish and then see it starts. It starts immediately. And I've noticed. Pretty nice. <laughs> how how see doing? how right now it's not. It's because it sometimes it takes a while until it does the whole translation thing. But now that you've done it, the whole YouTube is starting to create it. Oh, right. Okay. Sure. Auto translate. Let me see. There you go. Telugu. Oh yeah, thank you. There. Telugu. Maybe now I can remember. <laughs> yes. See, so you have the Telugu. It has so many languages. Look, like even Tibetan. Tonga. Tonga. See, it has so many languages, and it's helping because. Hold on. It already had here. See. Exactly. Yeah. Yes. See, and that's why, because you know, because I was thinking of doing the whole, you know, bilingual thing with me having English, German. I mean, most of my followers that I had on my YouTube channel were all Germans. So what I did was that I chose a. I'm just gonna show you real quick. I'm like, if you go to one of my, I didn't do it for all the German videos, but I think I did it for this one. When you go there, it starts with. Um, hold on. When you started in the beginning, I added a card here. Activate English subtitles. You see up here. Uh, you you might have to uh, uh, take away our window. But it's, you know how you can add cards to YouTube yeah. videos? And up here on the right, you see the info? Okay, okay. Right? So this info says activate. Well, now I don't know why it doesn't show now, but I have it here English subtitles on YouTube. So I recorded a video. So I made a little, you know, uh, um, I explain there, I talk a little bit, and then I show them where to click and how to get there. You see how to have the subtitles. And I also say that sometimes we need to wait a little bit for it, you know, for it to be. Yes, yes. And I figured it's easier if I do it that way and show them. And, you know, because I don't want to, you know, I would have to do to, to make a full tutorial on, hey guys, now I'm changing, you know, I'm moving on to English now, you're going to have to live with it. And I prefer them to have, you know, this, uh, uh, you know, like an info thingy. It's easier. Right? Okay. So that was the part with the captions. That's why I recommend everybody. It's for free. We don't have, you know, we don't have to, don't even worry about it. You know, just, just put it up there and that's it. You know, if you, if you know that your followings are, are that language, what you can do is play it and put the subtitles already in German. That way it's already loaded. In case so thank you so much for watching, for being here again on this ninth day of the challenge. I hope you're, I hope you're enjoying my Vlogtober and I hope you're, you'll stick around for the next Vlogtobers as well. Um, with this said, my wonderful, beautiful Dreamweaver. If you'd like to, my Wednesday, I'll, I'll add my Wednesday video here in the, in the end of the video so that you can go and look at it if you wish. And as always, my beautiful Dreamweaver. Stay magical. Until next time.